Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Ice the Temple. The Ice Temple. Woohoo! This the is my Dreaded favorite one. <laughs> <laughs> I've been looking forward to this. Some people view this almost as bad as the Water Temple in Ocarina of Time. Yeah, we watched a bunch of LPs of people playing it, and it was just hilarious. It can be quite the task to get through. <laughs> But hopefully we'll have seen what they did wrong, and not too bad. Yeah, if you want to get into this temple without having the fire rod from one well, of the temples a few back that we skipped, you have to bring the Bombos medallion that we can get in, because it's the only way you can kill these ice beasts without Which the fire rod. Which makes sense. Yeah, I mean, you bomb them, make them go on fire, and spontaneously combust. Pretty dread weaponry right there. Especially in an ice temple. Why isn't the whole thing melting down? Well, actually, it's probably for the best, also just being a huge, watery mess, I guess. Yeah, I guess Ganon, you know, had that in mind when he was decorating it. D decorating this temple here? Yes. With his interior designer skills? Yes, he obviously studied it very well. I mean, look at this. Look at these the placement of these... These... <laughs> I... Yeah. I don't know what that's look supposed to Look at that be. placement. Awesome. It's probably these good for blocks. the feng shui. Look at these nice blocks that he sets up. And, and he has those like pressure plates. And yeah. yeah, it's just awesome. He has them go back into place when she leaves the room somehow. Are these penguins or platypuses? <laughs> Platypi? I just assumed they were some kind of evil penguins. But they're green. Ganon painted green at some point. Not that platypuses are green, but... Why do you keep on hesitating with the platypuses? Is it platypi? <laughs> platypi? I don't know. I don't know. Like octopuses? Octopi? I don't know. Me neither. I never really thought about that in that way. Oh, get out of here, you stupid! Ugh, I, I hate those things so much. I don't to now. What the hell are you talking about? Platypi. All right. Can, can we just anyway. stop this whole platypus tangent here? This is making me very confused <laughs> and disturbed. All right, these jellyfish just don't die, so ignore them, I guess. <laughs> they just we have break to change apart the switch into here smaller pieces and change it again in order to get to that crack in the. I almost said ceiling, but it's actually the floor. Oh. And you can usually do it with the boomerang if you don't get stuck in that one spot like I'm continuously doing. Oh, You can almost. also do it with the bomb. It's kind of easier, but I want to save bombs. Come on, even though we have you can plenty. do it. See, Yay. I told you you can do it. Just have faith in me. I did. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you <laughs> did. Oh, careful. All right, so the whole point of this temple is falling down multiple holes. Kind of interesting, huh? And even though he means to fall down, he still does that, like, animation. You're like, oh, God. Yeah, you think you should have some kind of careful falling animation. <laughs> like, I, oh, I did not intend to do that. Oh. And, of course, the Stalfos, if you don't kill them right away with the bombs, they, they just, just come right come back. Right. Is this the first time we've met a Stalfos in this LP so far? Um, maybe. It might have been. Yeah, you have to hit them with your swords first to make them crumple up in a pile of bones and then bomb and then their bomb. remains in some weirdly disturbing way there oh the floor uh, just changes these spiky blocks what makes are it change being a pain i don't know gen has it automated to <laughs> just be a pain in the balls where did he uh, find this i'm stuff? trying to kill this guy what where do you think he purchased the supplies for this i, I don't temple? know blows <laughs> some gym fitness store <laughs> I, I have no idea and where did he find all these monsters I don't know, they were just chilling out one day, and he's like, hey, guys, I need to make a quick eight bucks an hour. <laughs> Come in my temple and just attack the green kid. There's going to be some kid that walks here at some point in this game. Just do your best to try to kill him. He has pink hair this time. But a lot of times, these enemies seem quite unaware of our presence. Yeah. They're well, I mean, they're not really getting paid around. enough, you know, so. No. They're just, they're like, half-assing it. Like, hey, occasionally, you do get something. Like, uh, the guards, they seem to do a good job of challenging you these blobs they try to go towards you but they're pretty ineffective well they don't even they have, have any no money weapon. on them see oh that guy had a heart oh, i'm not getting paid now he's enough. stuck there <laughs> that guy got one rupee the yeah, economics of the it. dark world are just all screwed up <laughs> okay and the penguins oh god i don't know if the penguins are trying to get you they just seem to be skating on their way across the ice but there's nowhere for them to skate too they're just gonna oh, oh god well i guess they are trying to get me look at yeah, that yeah maybe they eat kids I guess so. They're hungry. They're not I well fed. So. Maybe that's another strategy. Don't feed the animals, so they so they're come ravenous to eat and kill everything. I suppose so. They eat everything. Oh, and this ball of death again. <laughs> I I don't know. Are From those the top, needles? it kind of looks like a flower or spikes. I don't know. Some look like needles. Some of them look oh, like God. spikes. Guess it depends on your interpretation. Oh hey, a dead oh. end. It's these creepy shark 
or snake. Snake? I guess they're snakes. Yeah, they kind of have snake fangs, I guess. What kind of snakes oh. have fangs? Are all of them or just certain um, ones? The poisonous ones do. <laughs> I know that yeah. at least. Yes, away, penguin. The room to your right, you do not want to go in. If you go in there, you'll get stuck. Unless you have the hookshot, which we don't at this time, because we skipped the proper temple. Oh. So if you get stuck in there, just use your mirror to get out. But we're not going to go in there right now. Because I went in there before, but I had to cut it out because it was a waste of time. And we're trying to be efficient. Skating across this ice. Oh, that was fun. You see, if you don't have the cape, you just get injured left and right. <laughs> it's quite annoying. That and cape. it can inspire so some anger yes. issues. <laughs> But luckily, we have our keep. Yeah. Trusty keep. So, oh, oh, oh. oh. Yeah, you can slip oh. and slide trying to get into these doors. Just try to be patient and It's like careful. real ice. I know, it is real ice. Well, it's video game ice, but it behaves pretty realistically. All right, you're going to want to go down this hole here. Because there Ooh, are... Oh, a big chest. Even though there's a big chest and we didn't get the master key, and it's all the way on the first oh, or watch basement out. level, I don't know. Like, all the floors in this temple here are all basement, so it might be, like, B1 that we have to go to to get oh, okay. the key. But we have to go all the way to this floor in order to get some small keys. Oh, and we're getting attacked by the stupid anti-fairy, who is once again making Nobody my life them. a hell. <laughs> just come over here. Come here. Yeah, now you just want to come here. <laughs> what is their pattern? They just bounce? They just go diagonally, everything. and they bounce off of other objects. That's pretty much all there is. Although it does seem like they're trying to intentionally get you, I have to say. <laughs> Unless you're trying to get them, in which case they are away from you. That's true. Very <laughs> true indeed. Okay, so, um... Oh, I hate this. Uh-oh. Be careful. You have to be careful here. You might want to use the cape to avoid taking damage. Oh no, we are able oh. to do that. Yay! Surprisingly. I didn't really trust my abilities there, but it seems to have worked out. Kill those guys without Ooh. getting electrocuted. And you get another key. Sweet. What are we going to do with all these keys? What do you think? Open, Open up doors. doors. That's pretty much all you can do in these games with <laughs> keys. Unless they're keys, and then you kill them. You can only unlock the big chest with the big key. And there's no other chests that are stuck. locked. Oh, careful. He's going to get you. Oh, no, he's no, frozen. We have this. In place while you do your Don't spell. Don't you love that? No one can get you as long as you have the uh, spell in use. That's so useful. Oh, there's another one. Let's take care of this guy. Maybe you can get some magic from him. How about that? Yes. Oh. Thank you very much. Why did he turn orange? Oh, look at him. Trying to surprise me there at the last second. <laughs> you failed, sir. But oh. after this point, you come back to this room. And there's really nothing we can do over here anymore. But we do have that one key. Right. So with that, oh, we're going to try to avoid the penguins. Oh, get God, out of their way. evil. And what we're going to want to use is the mirror to get to the first floor. And the entrance to the temple. So we have to repeat some stuff here in order to get to the necessary place. That means once again using your fire medallion. Oh, Ganon, why medallion. did you design it this way? Unless you happen to have the flame rod at this point, in which case just use that to kill him. Your choice, really. Get rid of these assholes again. Die. Take a heart and go downstairs. So you're probably wondering, why are we doing this again? Why that's, are we doing this again? That's because we need this key. <laughs> it's very necessary in order to complete this temple. You might not have to do it again if you had the necessary items. I don't really know for sure. Because this is the way I decided to do it. And by George, this is what we're doing. <laughs> oh, George. Luckily, we don't have to mess with those guys again. Because we can just head on out. But we have to mess with these guys. But over here, yeah, we have to mess with these guys again. Because they lock the door behind us. So freeze them in place. There should Why be a switch under get there. The anti -fairy? Those Dumb. are a fairy. They're just too powerful. The only thing that can change them is magic power. Uh, Powder. Why what? I said ah. Oh, ah? Because there was someone why. coming towards you. All right, so once again, annoying jellyfish-like creatures here. And these are the ones that split. Use your bomb here, because it's easier than the boomerang, uh -oh. as we could see before. <laughs> Try to avoid taking damage if you can, but really, these guys are annoying. I but want they, that heart. they seem pretty oblivious as well. But apparently the heart doesn't want me. Aww. Can I get it with the boomerang? Yes, Yay. we can. Careful. Oh, now this guy's in my way. Oh. <laughs> wow, I can't believe I didn't take damage there. Sweet, you just skated by. Oh, there's going to be big guys again. Yep. 
so that means take out your bombs and get ready to destroy them. She and another one! Took Where are you? Okay, there he is. Yeah, they don't really appear until the last second when you're right under them, so that's kind of annoying. That is annoying. They're kind of like the hands. In the, the hands? Yeah, the hands that drop down from the ceiling and oh, yeah. get you. Yeah, we haven't quite been there yet. Well, we will, we in will other games, there. there are them. They in are other games, yes, there, there are. <laughs> that is true. Point well taken. <laughs> Except I couldn't quite articulate it correctly. Oh, well. What a shame. Oh, watch out. If you had the hookshot, you can just get across that other skull right there, but we don't. So we have to walk. Oh, no, watch out. Oh. And the line of globs. Yeah, those globs are quite annoying. So coming around to this place, you're probably wondering, what the heck are we doing right now? I are am. we really just going to go around in circles on and on and on forever? Yes. And, well... You can get stuck in a pattern of going around in circles if you're not careful here. As we've seen. Because in this next room over here, you're going to have a choice of three rooms to go in. If you go in two of them, you're probably going to be screwed. But now that we have the key, we can go to the door on the right. That is very good. And this is the door of advancing plot. I love advancing plot. Well, not much as plot as advancing through the dungeon, I suppose. Well, that's useful Not much exposition too. over here in this dungeon. <laughs> Uh-oh. As in any Zelda dungeon, usually. Oh, oh. get out of the way. Uh, this room here, oh, nothing no. we can do there, so ignore it. This guy's in our way. We're going to want to try to oh, take a hit on every <laughs> single time we go up through that room. But no, we want to go to this way on the right here. You can see that staircase. Oh, yes. And if we had the hook shot once again, we could have just gotten across using that. But, but instead, we, we have to use a cape. cape. Or we could always just take the damage. Oh. That's doable, too. What's over there? Well, now we have a new chest to go to. But can we blow up this crack in the wall? Nope. Nope. Some That's of them just dumb. don't work. Why is it there then? Red herrings? Oh, Ganon. Oh, Ganon. <laughs> you evil. Evildoer. You. <laughs> oh, my insults aren't that strong. Oh, well. Alright, once again, you know how to get these Stalfos now. Is he the only one in this room? They usually come in pairs. They do. They like to hang out together. Yes, we will not turn to a bunny this time. Aww. Oh, oh god. That was not watch what out. I meant to do. Watch out, watch out. You mean hammering the bomb didn't kill you? Oh, there's his oh, friend. And hammering the skeleton didn't work either. Yeah, you would kind of think that hammering the bomb would make it blow up, but it does not. Lucky for you. I guess so, but I still got hit by it anyway, so <laughs> doesn't matter. We have a chest here we can get. A map. It's the map. Which isn't much use to us, because I rarely read the maps in these games. Maybe it would help, but I don't really care. <laughs> oh well. Link is illiterate. He's only a child. In this game, I don't know what his age is supposed to be, actually. Oh, uh, well, he looks small. It's not small. very apparent. Yeah, but that's like the height of basically all the characters in the game. <laughs> I guess. Okay. And he was living with his uncle. He was, but still. Older people can live with their uncles, too. I guess. I'm living with my parents, and I'm not a child. <laughs> yeah. All right. Plus, people in the old days, they lived the family longer, too, anyway. Oh, it was a key. You know, medieval ages, so yes. would be close. So, now that we have the key, and also now that we have the big key, we can progress through more of the temple. Oh, oh, oh. That was close. The first... Oh. oh. <laughs> if we can get down here, the first thing we're going to try to get is what's in the big chest. And yeah. to get that, we have to bomb the floor, because that hole doesn't lead to good places. Oh, God. This one, however, will lead to a good place. I like good places. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and in the chest is, what is this, the blue mail? Blue it mail. reduces the armor, we t the uh, damage we take in half. Ew, I'm not a fan of the yellow hat. No? You don't like Link sporting that yellow hat? No. It that's doesn't seem to fit with the rest of the outfit, and it clashes with his pink hair. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of interesting. But Link was a rebel in this day and age. <laughs> the blue isn't bad, though. Uh oh, these guys. Oh no! And of course the Stalfos. Why are they joining everywhere? In the mix. Die! Well, these bombs will take out a few of them. Not, not quite as many as I hoped, but oh well. That's the thing with these red jellyfish. They're just always getting in the way. Definitely. I guess that's why so, they're that higher. So, in this room here, or the room coming up, we'll be able to reap the fruits of skipping one of the dungeons. Woohoo! Well, actually, we skipped several, but we visited one in particular, which was that Misery Mire place. Oh. 
And we got the cane of Samaria. Yes. You're probably right. wondering, when are we gonna use that? Now. Well, it just so happens that this is a really good time to use it. Because we can skip a significant portion of this temple. Ah. Uh, and and an, uh, if this dickwad speaking of annoying parts away. of this temple, <laughs> look at this him. guy is he absolutely looks like a baby. annoying. <laughs> So I, uh, this guy is seriously getting on my nerves. I don't want to use my magic, but he is making it really tempting. Oh my god! Oh dude. my! This guy is just. <laughs> oh well, you're failing there, but I still can't get in the door. All right, there we go. Oh. I guess when it comes down to it, just use your magic because he is a huge pain in the ass, <laughs> and I'm wishing I just used it in the beginning now. Oh well, he's gone now. So this is one of the last rooms we're gonna be in, and we have these crazy whack-a-mole creatures here, which are making some weird faces at us. They look like diglets, except not happy. The angry diglets. Yes. Yes. We're going to take them out with the hammer. Bam. Pop them in. And lifting up this oh God. heavy block Link reveals a, a new hole. Link face just like them when he had to lift it. <laughs> like, Maybe they're trying to lift something look down there. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh, wow. Oh. How do this they fit under there? This place is just a for jellyfish. How do they fit under there? Don't ask me. That opens the Bam. way out, but we're Bam. not going there. Instead, we'll collect a few more items, and now this hole will lead us to the boss of the temple. Oh my god, what's going to be? I'm scared. It's going to be unique. What? What is that? It it's like a, a cloud-like thing hidden in ice. I don't right. know. Whatever, you can just destroy it with the bombless medallion. It shatters the ice, and you can start attacking it dead on. It's interesting. However... Oh! As you see, it's split into three. Oh, it's like the jellyfish. <laughs> yeah. It kind of is, I guess. Why is it pink? <laughs> I don't know. Do you expect me to actually understand what they're trying to go for here? This thing. Ganon, right, why did you one. hire this? This was obviously the reject of the bosses. Oh, but oh, now no. we're almost dying. So use your cape for extra protectedness. Die already. Good lord. And try to finish them off. Yep, there we go. Yay. Yeah, as you can see, the cape just makes all these bosses so much easier to beat. I wish I had one in real life. It's definitely one of the items you want to acquire in the game. Oh, and I want to ask you here, do you want to read the part of the maiden, or did I do a good job last time? Um, you did a great job last time. But Are you sure you, you don't want to read it? I can read it if you'd like. Yeah, let's to. go. We can have a competition to see who reads it the best. Okay. I'm pretty sure I'm going to win, but go ahead. <laughs> Link, because of you, I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. They say the Hylia people controlled mysterious powers, as did the seven wise men. But the blood of the Hylia has become thin over time. We who carry the blood of the seven wise men do not possess strong power anymore either. Our powers will increase if we mix the courage of the knights with the wisdom of the wise men. Only a short time remains until the gate at the castle linking the worlds opens. Completely. If you defeat Ganon, this world will vanish and the Triforce will wait for a new holder. I believe in you. Good luck! Do you understand? Yes. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. Well, this is terrific. How do you, you think I did? Refill hearts. Oh, very good. Though I still think I did better. Anyway, I would end the episode here, but that guy's probably going to try to steal our shield, so let's go back to the light world. What a dick. Okay. So, I hope you enjoyed the Ice Temple. In the next episode, we'll be going back to some of the earlier temples that we skipped. Very good. So we'll see you then. Bye!